what is up everyone i am jamie with three little goats homestead um we haven't made a video in a while obviously because i had an accident i was hoping to make this video after my jaw was unwired shut but i seen oral surgery a couple days ago and they decided that it needed to be wired for another two weeks so i'm making this now hopefully the audio doesn't suck I'm literally filming on my phone because I can't go out to my office to edit. So I'm trying to do this all in big, one big take and not have to edit anything. So sorry about the crappy quality that it is. But I just wanted to say thank you for everyone for the thoughts and prayers. I've had a lot of questions as far as what exactly happened. I've had speculation that I was in a car accident, that I fell off the roof, that I got kicked by a cow. But what really happened was when we had our cow farrier come out, I think they're considered farriers. I made a video a couple months ago of our cows getting their hooves trimmed. Well, it was time for the rest of the girls to get trimmed. So we called him out and the big machine that the cows go in actually lifts the cows up. I don't know, I don't remember what happened exactly, but somehow I got stuck in the equipment and it lifted me up and it crushed my left arm. Thankfully my left arm isn't broken but I've got some damage that I've got to get addressed after everything else is somewhat addressed. Um, the biggest injury was obviously I broke my jaw so my jaw is wired shut. Fun fact I had my jaw wired shut 20 years ago so it's nothing new for me but unfortunately I also broke my neck. I have a C2 fracture. They call it a hangman's fracture. So they ended up fusing my C1 vertebrae, which is right at the base of your skull, down to my C4. I haven't seen neuro since my surgery. I actually go back this coming week to get the staples removed. If you follow me on Instagram, I've been kind of doing little updates there. But hopefully, once I go to see Neuro this week, they'll remove my chest plate and I'll be able to just use my neck brace, which would make doing anything a whole lot easier because right now I'm braced from here down to here. And it also is on my back as well. But thankfully, there's not too much nerve damage. Um, my hands are still a little bit numb, but I think that'll come back with time but I can walk, I can feel pretty much everything. So that's a win in my book, but it's gonna take some time. Jesse has a couple videos planned, so you'll probably see him a lot. And I may make a couple appearances right now. I can't really do anything on the farm. I'm literally confined to walking around the house and being inside unless Someone is right there with me to make sure I don't fall, obviously. So, but Jesse does have some stuff planned for the channel to try to keep videos out. So, I think I covered everything. It's really hard to talk, obviously. So, just know that I'm doing okay. We are holding down the fort, trying to get ready for an Arctic blast. So, poor Jesse and the boy are doing amazing at keeping the cows milked and taking care of all the animals while being a man down. And I think that is it. So I'm going to end this video because my face hurts. So obviously if you want to learn more about the machine that I'm talking about, I'll link that video if I can remember to. And if you want to go and check out some of our older videos, that really will help our channel kind of stay relevant in the algorithm until we can start really putting videos out again. And obviously, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, we don't put out videos every other or every week right now, but hopefully we will again soon. So if I don't see you in the next one, yes, you will. And I'll see you guys eventually. Bye.